Hey, hey, everybody, it's your girl Story Time with Miss Ty on deck. I hope you guys are having a great day, afternoon, and or evening whenever you guys are seeing this. So check it out, right? I'm after uh, it's after work for me. It's a long day, and I just picked up Penelope and my niece Mimi, and I took them to the park. So I'm sitting here in the park, living my greatest life, letting them live their greatest life in the park, and decided to tune in with you guys really quick. Today I'm going to share 21 popular popular YouTube video ideas okay so to all the people at home who you you're looking at this video or other videos and you're thinking about starting a channel yourself and you're saying oh but I don't know what to start it about here's some ideas to get you started because truth be told it's just people with cameras that's all so let's dig into it right idea number one you've become a story time channel right all they do is sit in front of the camera and tell you stories that they heard, that they made up in their own head, you know, <laughs> that they saw happen, whatever. Put your own spin on your own flair, but you could be a story time channel, okay? Number two, vlogs. Turn your camera around or get your selfie stick and walk it around with you everywhere you go, right? Well, not everywhere, everywhere. Like, please, no bathroom moments. Trust me, nobody wants to see that. Nobody. Okay, maybe somebody, but definitely not a lot of people. <laughs> Nobody really wants to see that. But anyhow, you can become a vlog channel. Put your selfie stick if you don't have a selfie stick. So what? Hold your camera in your hand and go around and talk to it. Hey, you guys, when I get up in the morning and I eat cereal, sit your butt down and eat your cereal. Oh, when I get up, you know, I usually do this, do that. That's all a vlog channel is. You can become a vlogger, right? Number three, cooking. Do you know how to cook? You don't have to be a gourmet chef because I've seen channels where they boil in hot dogs and eat it with chips. If you have an affinity for cooking, even if it's just putting cheese on chips and saying now you're going to eat nachos, go for it. Go ahead. Become a cooking channel, right? The more you learn, the more you grow, the more you create better content. All right. Um, number four, you can become a makeup channel, right? You don't have to do expert makeup, trust me. There's a lot of channels out here, and, and the majority of the channels out here that actually do it are not professional channels. They're not pros, but they're people who are willing to just get in front of a camera and do the best they can based on what they know at the moment. And guess what? That is cool beans. So if you want to try it, go ahead and try it. All right. The next thing you can do, you can do a cleaning video. Say if you say, oh, my life's not really that exciting. I don't do too much. Well, we all have to clean at some point, right? You can become a cleaning channel. Maybe you can start with your room messy or something and clean it up, right? You can become a cleaning channel. If that's your affinity, there are huge channels out here, believe it or not, that do cleaning. And a lot of people actually watch that. So you can become a cleaning channel. Pranks, right? Do, do you really get off by putting the whoopee cushion on somebody's chair or getting someone to believe something that's not really there? You could be a prank channel. They are um, pretty popular. I, I, I have seen um, a couple, maybe a few big channels that do um, pretty good pranks. And if you're into it, you can become one of the, you can become one of those, okay? You can do comedy. You think you're funny? You know how to make somebody laugh? Has people always told you all your life that, oh my God, you are so funny. Okay, people lie. Let me tell you that. <laughs> but aside of people lying, you can become a comedy channel, right? The best way to practice, turn your camera around, make it face you, tell your best lines, right? Now, then, uh, let's see, you can do the best and worst reviewed restaurants. Now, when I say restaurants, I mean locally. Now, say if you, we not all of us, but a lot of people have ate at McDonald's. Okay, maybe you never ate at the McDonald's on 53rd Street and where you live, you know what I mean? So go to 53rd Street, turn your camera on and say, I've never been to this McDonald's. Let's see how it compares to the McDonald's on 23rd Street, right? It doesn't have to be a lot, guys. I don't want you guys to overthink, you know, in order for you to be successful, being a YouTuber or creating a channel or just getting started. These are just the basics to get started, that you have to have this, that, and the other first, because no, you don't. All you have to do is have a camera that works and be willing to talk in some way. That's pretty much all you got to be willing to do, okay? Um, you can do music right are you a person who says you know how to sing you know how to rap maybe maybe you're really good with an instrument sit down record yourself doing a session go ahead upload it right what's the worst it can do nothing nobody will watch initially anyhow because in order to get engagement you have to participate in engagement so you know go ahead put something out there you can become a youtuber all right um the mukbangs we all eat at some point, right? Essentially, all a mukbang is is sitting down, eating, and talking, right? Of course, the people who have the notable, most, uh, you know, great personalities, they stand out a bit more. But 
go ahead, grab your dinner. Whatever your dinner is, it doesn't have to be an enormous amount. If you come from a big family and you usually get a, a certain portion size to make sure everyone can eat, eat your portion and enjoy it, okay? And have a light conversation while you do it. Upload the video, guess what? You're a YouTuber now. Okay, so you can do mug bangs. Um, DIYs, do-it-yourself projects are very popular and it doesn't have to be a lot. DIY projects work, so you guys can create DIY projects, right? You can be the next one, health and fitness, right? Maybe you just like to take a nice good power walk every day after you eat. Okay, that's good enough right there. Maybe you're more so into the calisthenic approach. You like to do your jump ejects, your squats, your sit-ups, your push-ups, your pull-ups, all that other good stuff, okay? Um, you can be a dog walker. Mm-hmm. You got a dog. You love it. You got to walk your dog at some point, right? You can be a dog walker. Turn your camera on and get to walk in Cool Joe right on down that street. And maybe you walk Cool Joe down the street three times a week and record a conversation you have with him. Okay? And if you guys do that, go ahead and holler at your girl story time with Miss Tan say, she's the one who told me to do it. Okay? Cool beans? All right. The next thing you guys can do. Um, anybody like to perform surgery? Right? So say you don't have your whole medical degree and all that other stuff. You can perform surgery, let's say, on a hot dog. Right? You can get, um, let's see, my daughter Penelope, she loves to perform surgery on meats. So sometimes I'll get her a little ribeye cutlet steak so she can go ahead and suture it up. <laughs> and she can do her surgery and live her greatest life because, you know, she loves watching uh, certain medical shows or whatever. And she likes to perform surgery, so I got her a suture kit so she can cut it open, she can sew it up. And you can do that too if you are into that type of thing. And guess what? You will be a YouTuber if you decide to share it with the rest of the world, okay? The next thing you can do is you can react to songs or videos that you like. What's your favorite playlist, right? If you hear a certain song, does it make you go crazy or nutty inside? Put the song on. Go ahead, have the camera on you, listening to the song, reacting to the song, upload the video. Guess what? You just became a YouTuber after you did it, okay? If you want, you can become a ghost whisperer, right? I have friends, you know, who are YouTubers who they like to go to haunted houses. They go to haunted houses and they see what's there. They see if they can interact with spirits and everything else like that. And if that is your thing, you can do that too. And guess what? Record yourself doing it and upload the video. Yes. Here's the punchline. You too can be a YouTuber. Okay. Now for all the people who like to play games, uh, I don't, I'm not a gamer, but I'm trying to think what's the name of some of the games that people like to play? Mm, what's up? GTA. GT, GTA? Mm -hmm. GTA. Or if you're into any stuff like that, any of the little boxing games, anything else like that. Fortnite. Guess Fortnite, very popular game, right? If you are a gamer, and you are watching this video or someone you know is watching the video and they're going to forward it to you because I said to um, guess what record them playing a game record them in their element are they good at it do they suck are they the best are they the worst it really doesn't matter record it upload the video and guess what they too that's right can be a YouTuber right okay you can walk in the park and collect cans if you want to you know why guys because it's just that simple all it is is a matter of the opinion of the person posting the video right so if i decide to get out this car right now and walk through this park i'm at and decide i'm going to pick up a bag and dig in the garbage and go for cans well guess what that's my opinion <laughs> you know that's that's what i want to do now if anybody else would like to look at the video and so that's very interesting you know people can leave your comments and say i'm so happy to see you were wearing gloves or you know i know a park that has a whole bunch of cans you know anything like that all you got to do is go ahead and put it out there and guess what you can be your own star that's right a youtuber Okay, uh, let's see, what else? If you want to, um, if for the people who like to act, the actors and actresses out there who are not yet discovered and you really feel like it's your calling to be in front of the screen, start with the screen you have, you know? Go ahead, do a piece, act out something, a skit, anything, and um, upload it, okay? Give yourself an opportunity to get exposure. You too can be a YouTuber. And the last but not least, we'll I have two, I'm gonna throw them in one. You can be a, if you're in, if you're really religious or spiritual, okay, if you like to read your Bible, your Quran, if you like to, you know, um, say the different things you, you say to Buddha, you know, whatever else, stuff like that, that's cool beans, all of it, all encompassing. Guess what? You can record a video of yourself saying what you're most passionate about in regards to your religion or spiritual beliefs, and guess what? 
you got a video right there so these are all great ideas to get you started and I think I said I'm gonna throw this one in there if you want to I recently saw a video I think just this year a few months ago about dumpster diving I never knew that stuff existed until a few months ago but that's a real thing and it's pretty popular so if you're into that type of thing or any of these things that I mentioned on this list you guys can go ahead and create yourself YouTube videos and these are just ideas to get you started now if this is the first time you see my face on your screen make sure to hit that red box and smash that notification bell so we can stay connected that part and if you decide to become a youtuber based on any of the suggestions I gave you today I am happy to be your friend okay you guys can make sure to follow me um, on Instagram at storytime with underscore miss m i s s t y t y and i will follow you back go ahead and shout your girl out if you decided to become a youtuber based on watching this video all right y'all yeah. all right guys i'm out of here but like i always say there's always another story to be told but for now bye